The first of the two on races is next. It's the Coventry Stakes over six furlongs, Group Two. Uh, we've got a field of ten for this one. Not that many two on races this week. Even away from Ascot, the Taj Mahal is at the top. For Darren Thompson, Aviador Trades, Matt Cooper, Braveheart, David Robertson, Gold Street, Martin Leedham, Ice Bath, Rod McClure, Lawman Town, Leon Van Rensburg, One More Dream, David Hooley, Quickly Does It, Joshua Sutherland, 73, Padre Hogan, and Statler and Waldorf. For Derek Hinton, a field of 10 in the rain there, and away they go. And who's going to be the first one to get into the lead? Right over on the far side, it's going to be Quickly Does It. And also, the Taj Mahal is out there quickly as well. And so too, Statler and Waldorf. And it's going to be Statler and Waldorf and the Taj Mahal who are going to dispute it through the first furlong or two. Then they're three or four lengths clear of the rest of them already. Aviador trades an ice bath, sharing third. Right over on the far side, then is Lawman Town. And then one more dream, Gold Street is down on this near side. But the leading pair, Statler and Waldorf and the Taj Mahal are a good seven lengths clear of the rest of them as they come down towards the midway point in the Coventry Stakes and Statler and Waldorf in the pink jacket. The Taj Mahal trying to give Darren Thompson a quick double over on the far side. These two are seven lengths clear of the grey ice bath. Then comes uh, Lawman Town trying to get into it. Gold Street's also trying to run on. So there's one more dream. Bravehearts after that. But now he says go on Statler and Waldorf. But look at this ice bath absolutely eating up the ground and sweeps into the lead. Then with a furlong to go. It's ice bath who's just swept right through to take it up. Ice Bath is now quickly in the lead, but he's being challenged over on the far side by Braveheart. But Ice Bath looks like he's got enough in hand. And up towards the run, it's going to be Ice Bath who's going to win it from Braveheart. Second, the Taj Mahal with third, then Statler and Waldorf, Lawman Town, one more dream. We lost one in that race as well. Joshua Sutherland's horse being pulled up. And then it's a win for Ice Bath and Rod McClure. So Rod McClure gets his name on the winner's role at Royal Ascot this year. Braveheart second for David Robertson. The Taj Mahal for Darren Thompson was third. Stutter and Waldorf, Derek Hinton fourth. And Lawman Tan for Leon Van Rensburg was back in fifth.